Culture Defined by Wikipedia.com is a sum of attitudes, customs, and beliefs that distinguish one group of people from another. Although there are a few similarities, there are major differences between a culture of South Korea and America, such as holidays, clothing, dialect, food, and religion. First, South Korea and America have a completely different dialect or language. Most Americans speak English, and it leads the pack of most common languages in the United States. However, the main language spoken in South Korea is Korean. The style of communication in general is also very different. In the United States, there are over 237.8 million people who use the English language as their primary language. When addressing or meeting someone, they tend to shake hands. In South Korea, there are 48.5 million individuals who speak Korean. When South Koreans meet or address someone, they bow. One other difference in the style of communication is that in South Korea, addressing someone is a great honor, whereas in the United States, it's not as a big deal. Secondly, the holidays celebrated differ. Even though the two countries have total opposite holidays, the way they celebrate them is extremely important to each culture. Americans celebrate holidays such as Christmas, Valentine's Day, and Easter, whereas in South Korea, they celebrate holidays like Liberation Day, National Foundation Day, and Buddha's birthday. The most important of the holidays in South Korea is Buddha's birthday, which is the holiday celebrated in East Asia to commemorate the birth of the Prince Guatemala. Both cultures are known to celebrate Christmas, but in America, the most important holiday celebrated by most Americans is Christmas. This holiday celebrates the birth of Jesus Christ which is a figure that represents Christianity for many American people. Next, the clothing that is worn also demonstrates how these two countries contrast in culture. Clothing plays a huge role in the rituals and cultures practiced in each separate country. In America, casual clothing such as jeans and a t-shirt are considered normal or casual wear. In South Korea, the clothing that is considered normal is somewhat different than clothes Americans wear during holidays. Americans wear dresses which is what Americans would consider dressing up. During South Korean holidays, the people wear items of clothing like jaguari or clothing called jokey while holidays are being celebrated. Next, South Korean food and American food are totally different. Food from both cultures express their culture in unique ways. Some popular examples of American food that people enjoy are pizza, hamburgers, and of course all kinds of fast food. Some examples of South Korean foods are rather different and unique in their own way. These food items include chili pickled cabbage and pork bulgogi. Even though the food in these two countries could not be any more different, they each represent something to these two cultures. Lastly, the religion surprisingly compare in some ways and contrast in other ways. Religion in any country is held very high and plays an important role when it comes to their culture. Religion in America include a high percentage of Christians, 83% to be exact. Those who don't partake in Christianity are Jews or no religion at all. Religion that is practiced in South Korea include a rise of Christianity and a revival of Buddhism. According to Wikipedia, after being suppressed for decades, Korean shamanism has survived and shamans continue to perform their rites. South Korea and America both practice Christianity and Buddhism. In summary, I found it very interesting to find how different American culture is from South Korean culture. I surprisingly learned how extremely prominent and diverse these two countries are from one another, yet compare in some ways also. Even though these two countries are completely different, they do have one thing in common. They hold both of their cultures very high, and each aspect of their culture is represented they are as a body of individuals.